Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about one of my Bath and Body Works regrets. Mm, 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 mm. You know how sometimes you see things and you're like, mm, it seems interesting or I think I kind of might would like it and you toy back and forth with it. Then you end up buying one and you wait forever to burn it and then you fall in love with it and realize the chances of you finding another one are very slim. And that award today belongs to none other than Leather and Brandy. <laughs> Leather and Brandy was part of the, I believe it was considered one of the neutrals um, collections for fall in 2022. And you know, I kept looking at Leather and Brandy. I would smell it every time I went into the store, every time it was a candle sale. And I was like, oh, you know, like, Maybe I'll pick up one, like who knows, we'll see. Maybe the next time they have a sale. And then when they would keep having sales, there were other fall candles that I absolutely loved. And instead of picking up more of <laughs> leather and brandy, I would just pick up the ones that I already knew that I really, really loved just to have more because, you know, what, what if I never see it again? Never thinking that leather and brandy would end up being the one that I regretted not picking up more and never seeing it again. Um, so with leather and brandy, it is warm leather, amber woods, and aged brandy. And it is just, oh man, it's, it's like a nice heavy hitting cologne type smell. Um, and it, oh, it just like transports me to just being like in a fancy new car and you're just, I don't know, just like riding out somewhere on a like bright sunny morning and just, oh, it just like, it gives you this like clean but masculine vibe. It, but the amber, it just, oh, it just transports me. It just, mm -hmm. Delicious. Uh, well, not even delicious, but just like scrumptious. We're gonna call it scrumptious. Um, I feel like with leather and brandy, it is it's a little more heavy hitting than the bourbon um, candle. I feel like this one really, really gives you that cologne scent because it has that leather. It almost like, it reminds me of a leather jacket. Not that it smells like one, but it's just like this, candle smells like what uh someone who wears a leather jacket like all the time like this smells like a cologne or a perfume that they would wear and put on all the time because it just like gives you like this boldness just like this strong like don't mess with me kind of vibe like it's just oh it's just like badass I you know, like I don't know how else to say it. it's just badass um <laughs> with this candle it burned very clean unlike bourbon Mm. Um, <laughs> it was just giving me all the vibes. Um, I burned it all the way down. You can see like a little bit of a wax that's left there, but oh, she's oh, just absolutely beautiful. Um, as far as projection, um, I feel like it did well in the living room. Um, would I say that it filled the space completely? Not necessarily, but having it on the coffee table, like I could still smell it when I was sitting on the couch. If I left the room and then I went back, I could still smell it. So from zero to 10, I would probably give it like a seven or an eight where it's not gonna be a powerhouse to completely like blow you out the water. But if you are in like cold weather and you have this going, like you're gonna be able to smell it. There's no denying that. Um, and you know, I find that with the very, very strong cologne scents, if they're super, super powerful, kind of like mahogany teak wood, it's like, it's going to take your breath away. It has a high possibility of giving you a headache. And for me personally, I'm just like, mm -mm, I ain't got no time to be fooling with that. Um, so, you know, with leather and brandy, if you can find one, hopefully they will come back out during the semi-annual sale um, this June. You know, who knows? Maybe somebody might have some back stock or something with everything going on um, with the outlets rumored to be closing down and whatnot. Like, who knows? Maybe leather and brandy might pop up again. But trust and believe, if my eyes find one, oh, I I'm buying that baby. Unless it's full price, then I'm like, hmm. 
I don't know, I'm gonna have to reevaluate. But if it's half off or like 14 bucks, leather and brandy's coming home with me, period, poo. Um, so yes, I highly recommend this if you enjoy like very masculine cologne scents and you want a candle that like you can smell it, but it's not gonna just completely blow you away. Like this is perfect, just absolutely perfect. Um, so yeah, that is today's uh, Bath and Body Works regret. <laughs> and hopefully I won't make the same mistake again with another candle that comes out. But you know, you live and you learn. But anyhow, thanks for hanging out with me and Leather and Brandy today. And I will catch you in the next one. Bye.